there's nothing quite like it, is it? The grace, the power. How long have you had it? Oh, well, I had some when I was a child, only I recently started collecting again. Now, this one's called the Seagull. Now, she was the very first locomotive I ever travelled on. Oh, I remember standing on the platform, just, just staring at her. Beautiful. And then my mother said, shut your mouth, Norris, you look like you're catching flies. <laughs> I'm the same with trams. I can stand for hours in the Science Museum. I don't think Ashley understands. Well, I'm the same. I, I, I've only got to reach out and touch the footplate and well, I, I'm transformed. That gush of steam across your feet and it used to rise up your legs and right up until you, well, you just disappeared into it. The smell of the thickness, the, oh, the two toot and then the chum 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 it's the freedom isn't it the romance the adventure all i ever wanted to do was drive the seagull you have to come on me tram when i get the job i know it won't be the same as the seagull i i won't be able to drive it would i no no but it is magical norris I came back on the tram yesterday, you know, after my interview. And you don't just drive through the streets. You go over all the old railway bridges, looking down on the buildings, chimneys reaching up from below. And I just know that when I'm driving, when I'm at the front looking out, it'll be like a magic carpet. <laughs> <laughs>